As I mentioned, the membership um, of organized crime groups in Japan is somewhat dwindling. There's also been increased pressure by the Japanese police on regulation of organized crime groups. This has been pushing organized crime group membership somewhat underground actually. So of the 53,000 members that are officially registered, there's probably a large percentage that are not registered. And I think this trend has been continuing as foreign investment continues in Japan. And organized crime groups know that foreign companies do more due diligence perhaps than Japanese companies. So they've been pushed underground. More front companies are being established by organized crime groups. So literally there are tens of thousands thousands of front companies involved in legitimate businesses as opposed to the traditional illegitimate businesses that organized crime groups globally are involved in, i.e. You know, human trafficking, drugs and, and the like. Um, nowadays you know, they are involved in restaurants, they're involved in, in um, construction, they're involved in real estate, they're involved in financing. So it, it, there is a shift in, in change in terms of the structure of organized and, and the businesses they operate. I think what's going to be interesting is 2020 when um, Japan has been successful in hosting the Olympics. There's major construction projects and businesses that are going to benefit that Olympic, um, you know, Tokyo hosting that Olympics. And we're already seeing suggestions of organized crime groups trying to penetrate uh, and make monies from the construction projects um, as a result of the Olympics, as well as I suspect going forward, you know, some of the other supplies and, and services um, that will be needed for the, for the Tokyo Olympics. So organized crime is going to continue. It's not going to disappear. There are campaigns, public relations campaigns that are being developed by organized crime groups. And in fact, they're so transparent. There are websites that are trying to um, recruit membership to, to certain groups, actually. So they are struggling, but they're not going to disappear in the near future.